Hi everyone, my name is Victoria Pakin from EasyRecipesWithATwist.com and today I'm here with my friends at RecipeLion.com who asked me to produce a video on this beautiful sweet potato casserole. This is healthy and savory version. So, if you like the idea, stay tuned! For this recipe you will need sweet potato, red onion, zucchini, salt, chicken bouillon cubes, I'm using two of them here, oregano, rosemary, garlic, milk, uh, black pepper, no salt seasoning and, and cheese. I'm using cheddar cheese, you can use any cheese you like, like mozzarella or extra old cheddar cheese, whatever you like. I went ahead and scalloped my onion, zucchini and uh, sweet potatoes. Now, take your uh, oven safe dish and place your onion on the bottom of the dish as a first layer. Then take your sweet potatoes and place them over. It looks a little bit over tight but it will be okay. Now I'm taking my zucchinis and placing them over sweet potatoes. Okay, I'm taking my rosemary and pulling it out and I um, peeled my garlic earlier. So this is my rosemary oregano and chopping them finely, everything together. It smells so good and so fresh in here. Spring is here, so it smells divine. Just chop it finely, everything together. Okay, I'm taking all together and I will mix it with, with the milk here. Now, my chicken stock cubes, I love to separate them, otherwise they're somehow stuck together. Okay, whoopies. I'm adding milk, a little bit of salt. You have to remember the chicken stock or chicken base, it's always um, uh, salty, so just a little bit of salt goes in black pepper and seasoning about two te teaspoons or a little bit more like I made but I will take it out so I'm adding half of my cheddar cheese inside and mixing all together It smells good. It's just really, 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 really good. Now I'm covering all of it with this beautiful, divine, uh, it's so good uh, mixture. Whoopies, whoopies, whoopies. And all of the flavors go on top. Yeah, you see all of those beautiful goes on top. Now, and the rest of the cheese on top, and pop to preheated oven for 350 Fahrenheit for at least uh, 45 minutes or until uh, the vegetables are fork tender. After half an hour start to check them. See you there! Let's try our casserole. Mm. It's amazing. Sweet, creamy, just incredible. And to think that this is healthy, just good for us. So. I hope you like the idea and don't forget to subscribe 
write me a comment. Thumbs up me and cheers, Victoria.